Music saved my life and it's still saving my life and it's just a gift to be able to do what I do. There was a lot of music growing up at home for me. That's for all camera. Sounds good. I moved to Anaheim when I was three or four and then ended up moving to Diamond Bar, I think in the first grade. Diamond Bar was a really creative space with a lot of opportunities. Like I started band and orchestra and sports, show choir, dance, and church and um, Korean club. My parents introduced me to like K-pop and K-dramas. And that's when I was like, I wanna know more. I wanna try on that type of fashion and makeup and music. And I think as a young teenager, that's when you really grasp onto your roots through arts and entertainment. Growing up, I had both my grandfathers at home since I could remember. So um, I love that I got to learn real traditions and mannerisms and just how to talk formally and informally. And then also because my parents are Korean immigrants and I am the first generation of my family. I realized they were so busy trying to figure out how to be American, but I think the best part is that we all have both sides. I lost my mom at 12 and losing anybody, let alone just somebody so important at that age, it, it triggers this emptiness and hunger that you want to really, really grab and fill. And nothing was really working until I started singing. It was sophomore year, first semester, and I was auditioning for a local talent show in LA. And I remember finishing the audition and the judges asking me, oh wait, um, how old are you? And I was like, 15. And they're like, oh, we're so sorry. This is for like 16 and over. And I was devastated. And I was walking off and going to the bathroom and there it happened were a bunch of other scouts from different labels. And then right then and there I saw SM's card and I was like, oh my God, this is, this is where my blueprint is. And um, I definitely was set on going to SM right then and there.